Welcome back to another video. I'm going to show you how to get rid of a hole in your lace. You're going to need some transparent thread and a curved needle. And that's it. So what we are going to do is we are going to lace up our needle. I just wanted to give y'all a quick nail cam because I thought that my nails are so cute. But anyways, we are going to take a piece of our thread and put it through our needle and get our needle all situated and stuff. When you make your knot at the end, you only need one knot. Do not keep knotting it because it'll be too thick. And then it'll look very obvious once you sew your hole together. So make sure it's a small knot like so. Once you get your knot ready, you're going to sew the two ends together. So when you do this, you want to go, go in the closest hole to, that's that's by the hole if that makes sense because if you go all the way back like you just saw me do i took it back out and went to a closer hole because the further the hole is away from the hole you might mess up and make another hole so stay close and tight okay and i'm just gonna stitch it all up you want to be very careful as well especially with like hd lace you want to be very careful that you don't over manipulate it because you will create another hole so just be very careful and mindful that this is a tedious job so just be careful be careful so yeah i'm just going to knot it all the way up to the top like you see me doing and you also want to use transparent thread because it's less noticeable if you were to use black or anything it'll look very obvious and we don't want that we want as natural as possible so once we are like this i'm going to finish it up with one more stitch for good luck and i always go through it one more time at the end and then we are going to cut off our extra thread when you also make this knot at the end again you don't need three four knots one knot two knots max will do the most g because you don't want it you don't want the knot to be thick now i've seen this tip before and what you are going to do is is um get you a hot comb get you a hot comb please make sure it's not too hot okay do this at your own risk but get you a hot comb and you're going to go over that little piece of thread because it'll melt a little bit the way the thread is it's not a regular poly polyester thread so this type of thread it'll melt a little bit which will make the a repair more seamless so yeah this is what you are left with and you still can't see from the other side it's very undetectable so i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up